So March Madness has officially begun. For those of you who may not know what March Madness is, it is the big college basketball tournament. 64 teams, only one can win. It is absolute madness every single year for sports fans like me it is something that everybody looks forward to but as part of march madness everybody fills out brackets they take all of the games and they try and guess the outcome of every game from the beginning to the end that means some games you don't even know what the games are going to be next weekend you don't even know who's going to be there you just got to guess who's going to be there and then so on and so forth it's so unlikely to guess but over the last few years everybody's been putting out other brackets for other things that are not college basketball and i love it so today i am going to hopefully be starting a series i am doing disney movies bracket this is my march madness disney bracket as you can see here we got it right there you can see my bracket and I've got my little pencil thing here. So you see all the matchups and I'm going to try to go through here. I'm going to have to abbreviate most of these because I don't have room to, to write it all. But we're going to start up here. We're going to go all the way down then jump across and do these as well. So we're starting up here with this matchup, Lion King versus Tarzan, which is tough because Tarzan has such great music phil collins went insane on that soundtrack but at the end of the day i'm sorry i have got to go lion king in this matchup as much as i mean tarzan i must say they put up a good fight but lion king has to pull through at the end up next we've got princess and the frog versus lilo and stitch that is another fantastic matchup because I love both of these movies so much but I'm afraid I have got to go and this may be an upset in some people's mind I'm gonna have to go Lilo and Stitch that movie I loved it so much as a kid I watched it every day and it holds a special place for me so I gotta go Lilo and Stitch I realize that may be an upset for a lot of people but I love Princess and the Frog too but I gotta go Lilo and Stitch up next we've got Tangled going against Big Hero uh, 6 two good ones but just for at last I see the light alone and the writing's gonna be horrible I'm just gonna put Tang you know what I mean. I'm going Tangled right there. Even though I do think, I mean, Big Hero 6, I saw that in the theater. Good movie. Very good movie. But I'm afraid I gotta go Tangled. Up next, we've got Frozen versus Moana. This is like the battle of like Let It Go versus How Far I'll Go. This one's tough. This is one where you feel like both of them should win. But at the end of the day, oh, this is tough. This may be the toughest one so far. Um, you know what? I, I, I love them both, but I think I'm going to have to go with Frozen. That, that music is just so good. For the first time in forever, love is an open door, let it go, of course. I mean, do you want to build a snowman? There's some great music in this movie. And, and the story is so good. But Moana is great too. Okay, our next matchup. Oh, Aladdin versus Hercules. This is similar to the Lion King Tarzan matchup. Dude, Hercules has such great music. Go the distance. Oh my goodness. But I'm sorry. All due respect to Hercules. I'm going to have to go with Aladdin right here. I mean, you just. Aladdin, I'm going to go. I don't want to spoil it. Aladdin's going to be tough to beat here. It's going to be tough to beat. Going down here to the Little Mermaid versus Pocahontas. Another tough one. Because Pocahontas does have one of my favorite Disney songs, which is Colors of the Wind. But at the end of the day, I'm sorry. Got to go Little Mermaid. Some of these, it hurts me to pick against them, but I got to go Little Mermaid here. Okay, we got Mulan versus Zootopia. To me, this one's kind of like a no-brainer. We're going to have to go Mulan. 
That's going to be like the worst A of all time. It looks like a Q, but that's Mulan. And then last but not least, we've got Beauty and the Beast. And I know it's kind of cut off down here, but we all know that is Nightmare Before Christmas. And my wife would probably pick Nightmare Before Christmas, but for me, it's going to have to be Beauty and the Beast. So that's round one. We got Lion King, Lilo and Stitch, Tangled, Frozen, Aladdin, Little Mermaid, Mulan, and Beauty and the Beast. Let's jump over here. Up versus Brave. I'm not going to lie. I'm not as familiar with Brave. So I'm going to go with Up because I'm just not as familiar with Brave. I feel like I can't pick it because I don't really know what it is. Now this is tough. Toy Story versus Toy Story 2. Now this is wrong. To have, to, to, to pit these two against each other is wrong. To they're all, all the Toy Stories are great. But I am going to go with the original Toy Story. Again, watched it every day as a kid. Come on. Coco versus Cars. Uh, again, I'm not as familiar with Coco. I've heard good things about it. But even if I had some, I mean, Cars, I mean, come on. Life is a highway, Rascal Flats. Come on. I mean, just how hard they went on that song alone. We're going with Cars, baby. We go down here to the good dinosaur against Toy Story 3. The heartbreaker that was Toy Story 3. I'm sorry, this is like no contest to me. I, I gotta go Toy Story 3. I mean, you gotta be kidding me. Ratatouille against A Bug's Life. Again, this may be an upset for some people. Because a lot of people love Ratatouille. But I'm going with Bug's Life. Gotta go Bug's Life right here. I, I, I mean, all due respect. Bug's Life, that's like a special place. Special place in my heart here. For Bugs Life. Okay. Finding Nemo versus Inside Out. Gosh, these are two that are sentimental favorites for a lot of people. But again, I watched this so much as a kid. Finding Nemo. I gotta go Nemo here. And I can already tell it's gonna set up a tough matchup. Bugs Life versus Finding Nemo in the next round. But I gotta go Nemo. Now, down here, this is Monsters, Inc. going against Cars. Now, I'm confused here because this Cars right here, is that Cars 2? I mean, it doesn't really matter because I'm going to take it either way, but if that's Cars 2, I'll just go Cars 2. I don't know. Down here, though, Monsters, Inc. versus either of the Cars, I'm going with Monsters, Inc. Come on, man. That movie's just too good. You gotta go Monsters, Inc. Over either of the cars. And then last but not least, The Incredibles versus Wall-E. And I'm just gonna put an I there for Incredibles. Again, that's not even really a contest to me. We're going Incredibles. Okay. So we move on to the next round. Here we go. Lion... This is tough. This left side's gonna be tough. Lion King versus Lilo and Stitch. I love them both so much. But at the end of the day, Lion King has such great music. Elton John, Can You Feel the Love Tonight, Circle of Life. Oh, Lion King's got to take it. As much as I love Lilo and Stitch, they had an upset in the first round to get past Princess and the Frog. But they ain't getting past Lion King. Lion King advances. All right, we go down here to Tangled versus Frozen. I'm going to probably offend some of y'all. But this ain't even close. I had a harder time with Frozen and Moana than this one. I'm going Frozen over Tangled. And some of y'all are wanting to punch the screen right now. But I gotta go Frozen. I gotta go Frozen on that. Going down here to Aladdin versus Little Mermaid. Again, two sentimental favorites, but I already told you. Aladdin's going pretty far in this thing. Because Aladdin's one of my favorites. The music is almost unbeatable. We're going with Aladdin over The Little Mermaid. Deal with it. Mulan going against Beauty and the Beast down here in our last matchup on this left side. And this this ain't even that difficult for me. Uh, it's it's going to have to be 
if I could type it, Beauty and the Beast is going to advance over Mulan. Some of these matchups in the second round were easier for me than the first round on this left side. All right. Jumping back over to the right, we got Up versus Toy Story. Not even a contest. Toy Story's taking that. Cars, either Cars or Cars 2 going against Toy Story 3. It doesn't really matter. We're setting up a matchup of the Toy Stories again because I am taking Toy Story 3 in that matchup. Going down here, I said this is going to be a tough one. Bugs Life versus Finding Nemo. Listen. I'm I'm torn. They both are so good. But I guess I'm just going to go with the one that I watched more as a kid. I'm going Finding Nemo over Bugs Life. That may be an upset to some people, but I got Finding Nemo. And then going down here, we got Monsters, Inc. versus The Incredibles. A tough match. Probably the toughest matchup on this right side for me. You know what? I'm going Monsters, Inc. I'm going Monsters, Inc. with a three at the buzzer to advance. So we got our Elite Eight. Lion King, Frozen, Aladdin, Beauty and the Beast, Toy Story, Toy Story 3, Finding Nemo, and Monsters, Inc. Back to the left side. This is when it gets tough. Lion King versus Frozen. Hmm. Tell you what. Frozen's had a good run here, but I'm gonna have to go Lion King. Give me the Lion King going to the final four. And we go to our other matchup, Aladdin versus Beauty and the Beast. Listen, man, I love Beauty and the Beast. It is a phenomenal movie, but I'm telling you, it's just, I gotta go Aladdin. I mean, it's just, everyone I look at, I'm like, dude, it's just not, I can't put it over Aladdin. Every matchup that Aladdin's had, I just can't put whoever they're facing ahead of them. It's just so good. Jumping back over to the right, another Toy Story matchup. Toy Story versus Toy Story 3. The original Toy Story already defeated Toy Story 2 over here. <sighs> Toy Story 3 was a heartbreaker. And maybe I'm just picking it because it's the sentimental favorite because of my childhood. But once again, I'm going with the original. And this ain't taking nothing away from the other Toy Stories. But I'm going to have to go with the original here. Toy Story 1. It's just, again, it's like the Aladdin of the right side, man. It's just hard to beat. A Lion King 2. It's hard to beat. Toy Story will be going against the winner of this matchup. Finding Nemo versus Monsters, Inc. I realize it's going to be an upset again. You may find it hard to believe, but doggone it, I'm going Finding Nemo. I'm going Finding Nemo over here with a Cinderella run. Cinderella ain't on the list, but Finding Nemo is on a Cinderella run to the final four here. And we're down to Lion King, Aladdin, Toy Story, Finding Nemo. Two of the toughest matchups here. We got Lion King versus Aladdin. I don't even know. I don't even know what to do here, man. This is... This is tough. This is tough. I'm getting way too invested in this. You know what? It's going to have to be Aladdin. It's going to have to be Aladdin going to the finals. It's going to have to be. I mean... You gotta think about the music. Not only a whole new world, but I mean, gotta keep one jump ahead of the bread line. Oh, that music is so good. Oh, just one of the best. And then we got Toy Story versus Finding Nemo. Finding Nemo had a great run. But give me Toy Story. Give me Toy Story to the finals. So now I don't know what to do here. It's Aladdin versus Toy Story in the finals. There can only be one winner. I watched both of these movies multiple times as a kid. A very special place for both of them. 
But there's one of them that I watched literally daily for years. And I have watched every movie in the franchise multiple times. It's going to be Toy Story taking the whole thing. It's going to be the original Toy Story taking the whole thing here. There you go. There's the whole there's the whole bracket right there everybody. We got Toy Story over Aladdin in the finals. There you have it. What about you? Why don't you take the same bracket? All you got to do is go to Google Images, type in Disney March Madness bracket. You'll see that empty bracket. I'd love for you to fill one out. Let me know your results. Because I know this gets pretty this gets pretty cutthroat. Why do my lights keep cutting off? This gets pretty cut cutthroat through here. Okay. People get serious about their Disney films. You let me know. You let me know. That's mine, though. I'll put it up one more time. Toy Story, Aladdin in the finals. Toy Story takes it at the end. What say you, everybody? That's my Disney bracket. March Madness, baby. Gotta love it. Take it in. Soak it up. Bye.